Hello guys, in this video I'm going to explain the difference between static class and singleton in C-sharp. Let's start with explaining both of these terms. The singleton is a design pattern. It is used to create a class that has only one instance and provides a global point of access. Let's see the most basic C-sharp singleton example. Here we have a public class which is sealed to prevent from inheriting from it. The class has only one static field with public getter and private setter. Private setter ensures that the value of the field won't be modified. Public getter functions as a point of access to the field. Below we have a static constructor which initializes the field. And a private basic constructor which ensures that there will be no way of instantiating an object outside of the class. Now let's talk about the static class. Static class is a class that contains only static members, cannot be instantiated, is sealed, cannot contain instance constructors, can't inherit from any base class, and can't implement any interface. Why don't we use a static class to build a singleton? It seems like it is a good fit to fulfill the singleton's requirements, to create a class that has only one instance and provides a global point of access. Let's try it out. This example looks very familiar to the previous one. The only difference is that we are now using a static class instead of normal class. It isn't the perfect solution for singleton because static classes have their limitations. Static classes contain only static members, they can't inherit from any base class, they can't implement any interface. That's why Singleton is not usually based on static classes. I hope that this quick video has explained you the problem and I hope to see you soon.